Hey, what is going on, everybody? It's Mavoda here, and welcome back to another episode of Subnautica. Now, um, full disclosure, I recorded an entire episode, which you guys will never see, unfortunately. Um, I recorded, went and did a couple things, even died a couple of times, um, but then went to go edit it and realized that my microphone had not picked up any of my talking so if i did put the video up you guys would pretty much just see a bunch of which who wants to see that so um yeah we uh did a whole episode did some stuff uh, let me catch you guys up on what we did first of all we did add a name to the locker that was shadow hunter and shadow hunter suggested in the comments that we call our base here um Mess, M-E-S-S, -S, which stands for Mev's Epic Survival Shelter, which I like that. That's dope. <laughs> so uh, thank you, Shadow Hunter, for the name suggestion. And uh, if you guys want to get your name on one of these lockers, leave me uh, like name suggestions down in the comments, uh, hints and tips for this game if you've played before, because I need help. And yeah, well, you'll get your name on one of the lockers. Um, one thing you might notice is you see my Seamoth is about a thousand meters that way. It's because we died like a couple of times in the last video that I that you'll never see. Um, <laughs> uh, pretty much I kept on pushing my luck with the oxygen and drowning when I was searching wreck sites. Because we are looking for the Cyclops blueprint. Uh... We need the engine fragments, and actually, if I take a look right here, Cyclops engine blueprint. We got one of them while I was out searching, but I did not find all three. We still have two more to find, and then we have the full Cyclops. One thing we did get while we were out, though, is we got a power cell charger, which is awesome. Um, we got this, like, thermo blade, which is a heated blade. I'm guessing that's a better melee weapon than our just our regular hardened blade. And we also got a modification station. Now, that's going to help us, I think, a fair amount when it comes to looking for looking for this uh, these final blueprints. Because we can get a high-capacity tank with that, which is uh, going to allow us to breathe a little bit longer. Um, let's see here. I think I got some stuff last time. Life pods. Okay, so, uh, so another thing is we found, uh, life pod number three. Let's check out the PDA real quick. Situation analysis complete. Communications relays, relay offline. Ultra crew number one. Damn it! How are we going to find another without a rendezvous signal. Uh, how are we going to find the others without a rendezvous signal? Here we go with my award-winning reading. We have a compass bearing on where the other pods went down. You want to just swim for it? If there's anything, if there's any rescue coming, it might be years away. I see a sea glide outside the hatch. If we can fix it up, we can get to the others and salvage the materials we need to build a permanent habitat. We're a few rooms away from relative luxury. I'm going out to see what I can find. So I'm guessing it didn't fare too well for him because their pod was down and they were dead. Um, what is this? This is another thing we got. Public document and independent authorities. Da, 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 da. Okay, this tells us a couple of things about the trans government. I don't want to read a bunch of government regulations right now, so we're going to leave that alone. Hold on. Um, we'll fill those up later. Um, you see our power's down to 375 out of 500. That's because I've been making a lot of water and food, just getting ourselves stocked up again. Uh, speaking of which, we should probably have some. Um, so, first thing I'm going to do is we're going to make that modification station. Actually, first thing I'm going to do is eat and drink. But then, second thing we're going to do is make that modification station. I went out and got some silver so that I can make some of the things. Um, let's see. I don't know if I have everything on my person, but we'll see. I need uh, that to start with, a wiring kit. Um, let's see here. 
Uh, we need a computer chip and two pieces of titanium. Okay. Uh, need... Do, do, do. I need, think I need table coral. Yeah, I need table coral. Let's go grab some table coral. There's some table coral. That was easy. All right. Get back inside. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thanks, Siri. You're the sweetest. All right, now we should be... No. Oh, we need two pieces of table coral. Dorp. All right, let's get out here and get another one. The long trip for another one. Oh, boy, we're back. Okay. Let's make our computer chip. Boop. And now we just need two pieces of titanium. I think I got a whole bunch over here somewhere. There we go. Um, I think I got what I need now. Uh, let's just put that in the first spot. Um, let's go over... Actually, let's go in the room where we come in. Maybe right here we can do it. Hopefully. Um, interior mod... Uh, yeah, you. Oh, here we go. We can kind of put it anywhere. That's cool. But we'll put it right here. Sweet. Okay. This allows us all sorts of things. We can do some Seamoth upgrades. Oh, that's going to be pretty huge. Um, hardened allows the Seamoth to go down deeper. Well, then. We're going to need aluminum oxide crystal, though, which we do not have yet. And we don't have the original pressure compensator. Okay. Um... Let's do, um, let's make a high capacity tank. That's a good idea. Uh, we'll get a little titanium. Oops, wrong one. Sorry, Shadow, you're not guarding the titanium. I think I needed to. I don't remember already. Um, oh wait, let's get, uh, can I take off my current O2 tank for this? Yes, I can. Awesome. Now instead of 75, you see our oxygen has a max of 102. Sweet. All right, survival knives, thermal blade. Um, we can use our regular survival knife and a battery, huh? You don't say. Well, I happen to have a couple batteries charging, I believe. Let's make that. Dope. Okay, anything else we can do here? Uh, swim charge fins, that actually allows us to, um, what's it called? Uh, yeah, it even tells you right there. Wirelessly charges your hand, your held tool while you were swimming. Cool. Propuls propulsion cannon, uh, or repulsion cannon, okay. And we need a pressure compensator for... First, I think we need the vehicle modification station for that. And for that, we need the moon pool. And to get the moon pool, we need the Cyclops that I've been looking for forever. Okay, um, so I am going to start the long trip of getting back out to my sea moth. And we need to be careful because another thing I didn't mention in the last video, uh, that uh, in the last video, I saw a Leviathan Reaper out here. And they're big and scary and uh, can hurt you pretty badly. So uh, we need to avoid him the best we can. So wish me luck. Let me get out there. I will be right back with you guys. Okay, and we made it back. This is where I so graciously died before. Welcome aboard, Captain. So let's get a little oxygen. I don't know if there's anything left for me to search in here yet. We shall see real quick. Um, I don't think I can go in there right now. I can go in there. We just need to be careful because this is how I died last time. I kind of got lost in the ship. 
and could not get out in time to breathe. So we don't want to do that again. Uh, let's quickly get our scanner just in case there is something scannable. Aye, aye. Okay. Um, let's see here. There's the door I already cut into. All right, air. I'm not being too. I'm not being too careful this time. Cause I'm not dying here again. I died at this wreck twice last time, actually. Oh boy, our energy is screwed on this thing. That's not good. Okay. I don't even know if we're gonna get the sea moth back home, because I only have seven energy left in it. All right. That's good to know. It's fine if we have to. We will go back as far as we can. And then uh, just bring a battery back out to it. Modification station. Already got that, but we'll take the titanium. Anything else around here? Can I get in you? Eh? No, it doesn't look like it. Um, are you already something I got? Stasis rifle? I don't know if I have that yet. Yeah, I guess I do. Alright. Let's get out to breathe again because we're about to go in deeper. We're actually going to head down this little hallway right here. Okay. Oh, this thing is losing power as I as I'm down here. Alright, good to know. Let's go in here. Let me through, please. Nothing down there. Appears we're at a dangerous depth now of 200 meters. Um, I don't think that would affect us right now, but if we, uh, if we did have the sea moth, we'd be dead. Or our sea moth would be taking damage. All right, I think... Is there anything left in this place? Particularly... A Cyclops engine blueprint fragment, maybe? Anywhere? Would be really cool. It doesn't appear so. Okay. Well then, let's get out of here before we die. Those scary noises are a little unsettling, but I think we'll be okay. I think. Right here we go, back out. Is it here? Which direction? 30 seconds. Yeah, no game, thank you. Oh, I came out a different way. Alright. Alright, that's it. Let's get out of here. Okay, we're gonna get as far back to the base as we can on our 5% energy. And we actually made it back to the base. Wow, I actually didn't expect to. But we made it back with 3% energy to spare. Killing it, boys. Alright, let's get, um... We'll get the power cell out of here. Eh, give me that. And you know what I Welcome should do? Board, well, first of all, do I have new power cells here? They're, neither of them are full. All right. Um, what I am going to do now, I guess, is we're going to try to make the, uh, ba the power cell charger. So I need another computer chip. I need another wiring kit, so that's going to be three pieces of silver. All right, that's going to be fun. Let's go find three more pieces of silver. Okay, we got what we need, I think. I do believe. So, we should be able to... No? No computer chip? I thought I just got... I didn't get table coral. I got common coral. <sighs> okay. Uh, let me just go... Oh, I have a full power cell. Okay. I'm going to throw that in, um... Sun is setting. It's fine. Oh, look at our hot sizzling knife. Thousand degree knife challenge thing. Alright, um... Okay. 
Now we should get it. There we go. And we got our wiring kits. And now we should be able to do a thing. What were we doing? Oh, one of these. We just need some glass now. I think I got that. Uh, do I have it here? All I have is enameled glass. Okay, we can make glass, actually. I have quartz. So we'll do that. A little glass. Oh, look at the heat rising off my knife. That is crazy. So wait, when I do this, do I just, like, put it in my pocket? Because that doesn't seem safe. And let's uh, charge up my battery here. Yeah, that one. And we'll put in a new battery. Okay. Um, I think I got what I need now. I just need um, my habitat builder. Put that there. Um, where are we going to put this guy? I guess... Um, those guys are actually getting a little annoying being in the hallway there, so I'm probably eventually going to move them. So for now, this guy will put... Where do we want to put you? Eh, let's put it on this back wall here. Why not? Sweet. All right. Power cell. That's not the power cell we want. We want these power cells. Excellent. Uh, you? Oh, I can only do two at a time. Good to know. All right. Um, so I need to do some fixing on the ship. I need to... Oh, man. I need to do a lot of stuff. Got to do a little bit of homework so I know where to go find those Cyclops fragments. Pretty much those uh, Cyclops blueprint, uh, those Cyclops engine blueprints are all that's holding us back right now. Uh, actually, there are some other things. We do need like aluminum oxide crystals, but getting a Cyclops blue, uh, Cyclops would certainly help with that. And, uh, yeah, I need to figure out where to get the final pieces. We need two more fragments of the blueprint. So, I think next episode we're going to get determined. We're going to put our foot down. And, oh, wait, I didn't show you guys this, actually. In my office, I have a little toy now. Woo! That's awesome. Oh, and a lot, another thing I didn't do uh, show you guys last time. I did a couple of scanner room upgrades. Um... I did the range and the speed, so pretty much it's, like right now it's scanning for Rex, and um, it should be doing it a little faster now, so that should be helpful. Um, but yeah, I think we're going to call it for today. I know it's not the most exciting episode, but we did do some base upgrades and things. We got the modification station, we got the power cell charger, but as I said, we need that Cyclops, and soon. I know a couple of you guys have commented down below telling me so as well. And I agree with you. We need it. Um, but yeah, I think that's going to be it for today. I really thank you guys for watching and I do hope you enjoyed. If you do want to get your name on one of these lockers here, don't forget to leave me suggestions down in the comments. Or, uh, you know, uh, tips, tricks. You can roast me if you want, but if I, you know, I won't put you up on the wall unless I think it's funny. Um, yeah, but uh, I think that's going to be it for today. Thank you guys for watching. Bye-bye.